What's going on there, folks? Uh, good morning. Just a real quick update uh, here from the Earthmaster on this uh, Tuesday, January 11, 2022 date, about uh, 4.54 a.m. California time. Got a whole bunch of earthquake activity ramping up in the uh, Alaska region within the last couple hours here. And uh, just right now, another earthquake coming in to the uh, live seismographs here. Looking pretty darn active. Uh, kicking up here so let's go ahead and look at this real quick another six pointer coming into the Aleutian Trench area this area was pretty darn quiet last night uh, of course we've seen a whole bunch of movement worldwide uh, including the activity around the Cyprus area looking at this movement here in the Aleutian Trench we had a 6.8 kickoff uh, looks like there was a couple four shocks here uh, within the region, looking at this map here, seeing a uh, at least one 4.8 within the vicinity of the 6.8 here. Struck about 22 kilometers uh, below the surface. Quite a few aftershocks in there as well. And now a 6.5 that's just coming in, uh, kicking up in this area around the uh, looks like the Fox Islands area I don't believe there's any type of tsunami warning or statement I do like to check those out real quick uh, this area right here very capable of producing uh, a much larger than a 6.5 uh, earthquake check out the buoys up there see if anything's in event mode looks like things are uh, active it looks like but then again let me look here real quick here, folks. We'll get back to the buoys here in just a minute. No tsunami warning or watch in effect, but there was definitely some in, a, in event mode here. I'm still half asleep, so I have to pardon me here real quick. A little bit of adjustment there on the uh, water column height station at least on three stations along the Aleutian Trench. Nothing significant, uh, but it looks like there was a little bit of a trigger, a little bit of adjustment, but uh, so far I don't see any uh, tsunami warning or anything being put out here by the, uh, there we go, the uh, U.S. Tsunami Warning Center. But... Uh, with this type of earthquake activity occurring, folks got to be on guard out there because this area is very capable of producing a much larger, like I said, uh, than a 6.8, 6.5 uh, earthquake. So could be four shocks. Who knows? Hopefully not. Uh, but it's definitely something to watch here pretty closely as we're seeing kind of an increase in the, uh, the 6.0 magnitude range. And on the... Uh, on the uh, accumulated stress area of this region we could see quite a bit of a quite a bit of larger movement here uh let's see that's about the only area that has really ramped up ramped up uh following all the activity overnight i uh, will do a complete update video this morning uh, as i wake up it's a little bit early right now uh, but i will be back a little bit later live stream is up somehow and i don't know why yesterday the uh, stream actually the computer reset I uh, went ahead and got that restarted, and then uh, uh, overnight, when I was sleeping here, uh, my stream ended. It's as if somebody hit the end button on the uh, streaming page, but uh, I didn't. Nobody did. So, some weird stuff going on here with the computer uh, and the stream. Normally it does that when things really start to ramp up, so it definitely... Uh, just kind of weird it's a little on the odd side let's go ahead and check out the uh, regional information uh, page here on this earthquake activity at least over uh, historically you can see quite a bit of large movement here looks like uh, in the past but uh, like I said we'll get to that uh, a little bit later on this morning in a complete update uh, I want to check out the 6.8 see if uh, Looks like a few folks did report feeling this uh, earthquake in the region. The uh, shake map up here, of course, 
around the epicenter is going to be pretty significant distance wise uh, luckily this was not around a super highly populated region but uh, still good to uh, be on guard out there folks a lot of movement taking place here along the pacific plate once again 6.8 in the alaska region and a 6.5 just coming in right now uh, to the live seismographs here you can see the uh, signature of that uh, 6.5 on some of the stations i have pulled up here including a bc station and also uh uh, also, it looks like the uh, Petrolia station here in Northern California picking that up as well. So, all right, folks, we'll be back. Sit tight. A uh, whole lot of stuff going on. We'll be uh, we'll be watching this here.